the ones behind. So those, the Erebus Motorsport SLS oh. and Wolfie Reap was the, that drama. That's the 93 car. The 93 car, we got a quick shot off. Oh, oh massive oh, crash. The 91 of, this was, was the Mazda, the Mark car, and that is at the top of the mountain, right next to the 7 New Skyline, and that is surely more than one car has been involved in that, or has he just hit the wall so hard that it's destroyed the back of that car? Now, there are panels that are meant to deform and come off, so that looks bad. This is the Recaro Class I car that's been vying for the lead with the 93 Mark Cars Australia team car, the one that's shaped like the Focus, and... No movement at the moment, but it will be a safety car because of the severity. Look at the right-hand side rear has been ripped off. That is a rear drive car, and the Super. drive shafts are, are I'm afraid, uh, visible there. Ivo Bricker's behind the wheel, too. So second in class. Unfortunately for him, that's the second time he's found the wall here today from that kind of an incident. Thanks to everybody keeping us aware. Here's a look. Oh, no, down the inside. One of the Phoenix racing cars, the 16, and that is a monster crash. Oh, dear. Well, if the race control follows protocol, that's going to be at least a drive-through for the 16 car. If you give that to the Bentley earlier on for the one at the chase, you've got to give it there as well. We spoke all day today about risk minimisation. And that was Felix Baumgartner. Mm. And not taking chances when you're lapping cars slower than you because... There's no point, and unfortunately, it ends up in things like that. Oh, and yeah, just man. unluckily hits the unguarded part of the concrete wall. There's so many tyres, you'd think it would be harder to uh, hit the wall than anything else. And, of course, the 